Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's. I can't, I can't do that very much, mate. I can't because I, I, I've got, I've pulled a muscle or a tendon or something, and like, ah, I don't know what it is, mate. It's really hurting though. It's right. It's either right in there, or it's it's back here, mate. It's terrible. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Casper's. How the devil are you, mate? Today. We're going to be looking at a little channel called Twin Paranormal. You may have heard of them, mate. Make sure you go over to their channel, subscribe, and do the thing. And get them up to a million subscribers, please. All right, because they're on 209,000 at the moment, all right? And this video is called The Scariest Night of Our Lives. The Howard Street Home in 4K, baby. So, look, the scariest night of our lives, this should be a bloody good one, mate. Loads of you have been asking me to react to them, so without further ado, Dar Dilly Day, let's do this. Shh. Go on, Twin Paranormal! Howard Street Home is a beautifully decorated Victorian-style mansion, complete with lavish there bedrooms, a music room, a reading room, and a full dining room. When your life's been put on hold for far too long, far too long, when the sorrow and despair is growing strong. Two different growing signs are posted strong. outside of the front door that say, welcome guests and spirits rest here. What is now called the Howard Street Home was originally built in 1859 as the Golden Curry Mining Company. This building served as the main office and home of the superintendent of the mining operation I was gonna say Super Nintendo. in the nearby Ofer Mine. The first of which to live in this building was none other than George Hurst himself. Maximum bid, please! Reported that uh, George Hurst was the original person that built this home. He spent not a long time in Virginia City. He lived in the superintendent's building for only three years. And uh, he probably wasn't a nice person from what I've read, but he was a very good businessman. So he sold the place in 1866. The home also served as a passing residence for the famous John Mackey in 1870. Over the years, many different people bought the mansion and used it as a home of their own. There are multiple famous names to the house that did this, including a man named Robert, and years later, Victor and his partner, Patrick. He passed away in the home. Robert passed away upstairs in his bedroom. He sold it after his death to Victor and Patrick, and Victor and Patrick lived together. They were partners, I believe, for 20 years. Everybody loved Victor and Patrick, and then Victor passed away in the house in the front room here. His ashes and Robert's ashes are both in the front yard. Rather help oh, wow. Okay. Me up. I've fallen down. Each of these people can Maximum sad music, please! ...cared greatly for the property and the home itself, and they had decorated it, redesigned it, and refurnished it many different times over the years. The current owners, Michelle and Jason, purchased the home in 2017, and they lovingly restored it to its original Victorian mansion style. With prior experience in hospitality and service, they revamped the building to be their own bed and breakfast in which they live. I don't know how I... Be so dumb. I, 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 I still love the production of this fucking channel, mate. It's so fucking good, isn't it? Hey, it's so bloody good, mate. Look at you. What makes this home truly special is it also has its fair share of spirits that definitely do rest there. Over the years, the owners have received many different reports of spirits that are in fact in the house. Many different psychic mediums and investigators have come into the home, as well as guests who claim to be sensitive to the paranormal, have all claimed that there is definitely some type of activity here. Throughout all of the different experiences from everyone who has reported this, they seem to think that there's close to 10 spirits that live in the house. What? Quite a few of these- Fucking Ghostbusters, here we come, mate. Let's go. Events that have happened in the home that people have experienced have actually been very unique, and there are many stories to tell about them. Leave it all behind. Oh, God. Let it all go. I've actually seen a full body apparition. 
What, what, what the hell are these images, mate? Walk through the front of the uh, pellet stove as you enter into the house from the front door. Jason's uh, more sensitive than I am to these things. I know what I've heard and I know what I've seen. And I saw the same apparition walking across our porch. And one of our guests, less than a year ago, I think it was like just in December. Yeah. She captured a picture in the evening uh, in the backyard. And she sent it to me and she goes, is this your lady in white? And I what that for fucking maximum heights, please? Jesus Christ, mate. Was she 19 foot tall and thin? Wow. I don't know, mate. I don't know. That just looks like a, a blur. No. Really? It could be. Could be. Could be tall and slender. The slender woman. I can't believe it. And I said, yeah, I said she was very, very thin. This story kind of. Mate, this is some weird ass fucking visuals going on here, man. Creeped me out. We've uh, had a young man stay here. Yeah, he, he was uh, staying in the Cartwright room and um, he came out for breakfast in the morning and he said, I got straddled by a lady and was choking me. And it's really <laughs> sounds okay. Scared <laughs> enough that he left and he left his luggage, and we haven't seen him since. <laughs> They say children are very um, sensitive just by their nature of being so young and open-minded. And one of our guests, she was three at the time. Yeah, about three and a half. And about three and a half. And uh, she loves the parlor. She likes to play in there. She calls it the castle room. And we were all having breakfast. We couldn't get her to eat breakfast. She comes bounding in and she goes, Mommy, can I see the baby in the box? The lady says I can see the baby in the box. The mom looks at me and I go, I don't know about a baby in a box. No, I don't know. So What's in the box. We just ignored her and we moved on. And that was in March. Well, in May, I bought a book here in Virginia City and I was reading about stories from the Territorial Enterprise, which was the newspaper up here. And it mentioned that two miners were digging up on Sutton and Summit, which is right in front of our house. And they found a small coffin and they opened it up and sure enough, it was a baby. Oh, fucking hell, man. With the baby was the newspaper laid on top of it September 1873. I called the mom and I said, do you remember what your daughter was saying to us this last time about, and she goes, oh yeah, the baby in the box. And I read her and she put down the phone. She didn't even speak to me. <laughs> she came back and she goes, that is so creepy. Give me the name of that book I'm going to order. <laughs> Most notably, there seems to be some type of spiritual ah. portal that leads from the original back door to the front. Right by the grandfather clock as you walk in past the pellet stove people have said that seems to be a portal people seem to be coming and going from there and that's where i get a lot of orb activity that's flying from that area it seems to fly through the front room and into the kitchen sometimes you can even follow the orb as it goes into both rooms it you know goes to yeah, another see you, mate. some of them are slow big some of them are real fast numerous people have said there's people coming and going you have some that live here all the time but you have other people that seem to come and go from that area some of the things that that guests have encountered themselves have ranged from downright creepy to just terrifying. All in all, the house has a very welcoming feeling when you step inside. With all of the things that we have heard that are going on in the home, we are very excited to have been invited as guests to find this out for ourselves. Yes, Tonight, mate. Maximum. Let's go. We are Let's hoping to find out it. if these owners are truly still there. And with all of the activity that we have heard reports of, who knows what else we may run into. So let's go. Yeah. Let's ramble it, mate. Let's go. <sighs> okay, guys. So one of the weirdest things that we were told was that this doorway from there he is. here to that door is supposedly a portal. And there's been multiple mediums who have come here and just other ghost hunters that have come here. And right away, the mediums know and feel that this is a portal for spirits. Other ghost hunters and people investigating this place have also noticed that there's something very odd with this walkway right here. Look at look at Nick all blinged up, mate. Gothic blinged up. He's like a he's like a gothic SAS marine dude. Look at him, hardcore man. While we were setting up, we have a night cam pointing from over there to this direction. And we noticed for some odd reason when Nick was walking by himself, we noticed that we can see straight through his body. It's very odd. What? It's like he's a, a spirit himself. Yes. What? He's literally just standing here walking around. You could see the whole shelf, everything. You could even see the books straight through his chest. They had me walk over here and the same thing happened to me. 
which is very odd. None of the other cameras are doing that whatsoever. Maybe demonstrate. You know? Do you wow. think you could? I could? Okay, so Nick is going to go in there. He's going to see if it happens to me. We're going to shut this light off, and I'm going to show you guys straight through this camera. What the hell? So I'm just going to kind of be walking around here. And what's weird is when you go up close to the night cam, it goes away. Only in this general area when you're walking through here. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, yeah. I'm going to demonstrate when I walk towards it. It just goes away. Very odd. We spent a good 30 minutes just looking at each of us. Is that just like a, 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 a camera glitch, you know? Just like a... a camera just being a bit slow and glitchy? We're trading off and trying to find out what was going on and why. It's never... Never, never happened in never any happened. videos. You guys have seen multiple videos that we've used these cameras and not a thing ever happened like that. Watch your wine glasses. There's a step here. <laughs> That was me, literally. Oh, God. <laughs> this room's beautiful. <laughs> wow! <laughs> How did I just catch that too, bro? What did he do? He's just I mocking looked. me. <laughs> so, yes, we were in here setting up that camera. The lights were out and River's, you know, just walking through and he's just straight trips almost each shit like this. Whoa! It's like a drunken bitch. <laughs> a drunken bitch. <laughs> I'm so glad I zoomed into you because now everyone knows that you're a jerk. I'm not. Okay, okay. Now it's for the investigation. Okay, you've Let's seen go. us walking around this beautiful home. We just want to know if you used to live here at one point or if you lived on the property and we want to know how you got in here. We're trying to find out if there is a portal for you to travel through here and for any spirit to travel through. But before that, I'd like to introduce all four of us. My name is Ryan. My name is Nick. My name is Wyatt. My name is River. And we're just here to communicate with whoever would like to have a conversation. We're not here to anger anybody or make them feel uncomfortable in any way. We have these objects that you can use as much energy from a couple of things that we have in our hands. And you can speak to us through these objects. So first things first, I'm going to start with this object here. If you use your energy, if you can manifest enough, the green light should be able to go as high as possible. It basically starts to show more colors with how much energy you're able to produce. Like I said, if you need more energy, feel free to use anything here. What's in that? And the distance said, you see that shit, mate? Over here? House, anything on the guys. What? You can use whatever you'd like. We're just trying to see if you are here with us. What? What? Footsteps. It sounds like the... Okay. So we, we took our shoes off because the wood floors in here are so loud. And I shit you not, I straight just heard someone. I literally... I just heard the wood floor. No, you didn't. Yeah. I didn't even yeah, hear no, that. No, I did too. I heard one and then I... Hey, what the fuck is going on out here, mate? Who is that? Is that them? Three after. Right when you started talking about it, actually. I'm just gonna set this right here. Please, feel free. Show us that you're here. Use your energy. We can move away if you don't feel comfortable enough. We're just trying to gain a little bit of your trust. And hopefully, it would be great to have a conversation. Maybe you haven't had a conversation in quite a while. A couple of people have- Yes, mate! It's been 300 fucking years! ...said that they've seen you plenty of times. They just haven't necessarily spoken to you because they didn't have the right objects like we do. I have one of those devices of my own, and I'm gonna turn it on and stand over here. I'm half expecting fucking grenades and, 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 and machine gun magazines out of his bloody vest and shit, mate. So if you're already in this room with us and you'd like to get close to me at all... What? That's Wait, by what? all means. Exactly like that, thank you. Go next to you, please make sure nothing around will set that off. Nothing on me. What the hell? Is there any way you could do that again? That was actually really cool. Do it again! The closer you get to this, is the higher it's going to read. So Come when on. you're really close, it's gonna go to red. Do you think you could light up the colors again? Did Just yours. They're listening to you. What? Thank you, are you walking back and forth? I heard, I heard that. something, and now I am 
cold, bro. Yeah, like, I'm, I'm very, very cold. Uh huh. I'm freezing. Just a cold spot. Victor, we know that you're in here and this used to be your home. It's a beautiful home. Oh my god, that's so amazing. I thought I heard something in the distance, too. I heard a noise. <gasps> okay. What? I think I heard that. I heard a noise. <gasps> yeah. Yo, what was that? Where did that come from? That sounds like the kitchen. Yeah, that was closer. That was close and loud. Victor, are you here? Can we please speak with you? Oh, mate. Fucking lights are going off everywhere, man. It's like fireworks. Victor or Robert. We don't know any other names. We know there's multiple spirits here. We know <clears throat> Victor took a huge part here in this home. Through a bunch of great parties, had good times. And we just want to say we're here to speak with you or whoever is here. And we do know there's also a Robert. If there is a Robert here. Please speak Shit, mate. Okay, okay, sorry, you couldn't see that, but it's just flicked over to this yes, camera. We know that the previous owners, like Victor and Robert, really enjoy parties. And now we were invited here as guests, so think of our- Let's party, baby! <laughs> stay here is almost like a party. That must be them moving around in, in there, because they're not in here. That, it must be them, but I don't know why. What are we looking at? Why do they keep on flicking over to this camera? Are we seeing something? Like orbs or something? We're visitors, and we want to have some fun. We want to speak to you. River and Nick had already cracked into the wine, too. Pretty sure you liked wine. There's a fresh bottle in the kitchen. If you'd like us to go over that way, could you make a noise, maybe? I love the way they all communicate to these spirits. It's so, like, I don't know. I don't know. It's just, it just flows really well. When I was doing the investigation, it's, just, it's hard to think of questions and shit, you know? Whoa. Oh, that's... Wait, did I just hear that right? You heard that? Yeah. Did that sound like hardwood? It did. That's what she said. Would you mind if... <laughs> If we used a couple more objects, would that be okay? That was right there. Was it? Yeah. It was a creek. So we have this new REM pod. This one has two antennas, so it can cover 360, and it'll just cover way more. So we're going to go ahead and set this in the middle of the portal area. What? Okay. Okay, Victor, Robert, or whoever is here. Oh, it is them. It is them. Okay. This object, what this does, if you get close to this metal rod, it starts to make a chime, it starts to ring, and that'll let us know that you are close by. I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate it real quick. All you need to do is go that close. Shit, mate, that's fucking loud. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, Ooh. wait, wait, hold on. Nothing's near. Can no you object. do that real quick? Go near it, please. Give us a sign. If you can hear Hit me, baby, one more time. Now go to that. Let That's it full in. red. Full Walk red. Ask me. You're doing it. Yes. Wyatt? <laughs> Did you <laughs> see that? This new device. Dude. This Thank is you. Cool thing. So our baseline is completely off. There's no signal. Nothing around it that's setting it off. The fact that it's going off at all means something. Yeah. Something's close. Victor, is that you? I'd be like, stop the clock. Stop the bloody dog on the clock, mate. Can you make that go off? You're filming it, guys, please. Thank you. Guys, I think we're talking to Victor. Victor used to be Victor. Own this home. <laughs> Your ashes are spread in the front yard, aren't they? He's like, ashes? I'm a fucking dead, am I, you bastard? It means a part of you is still here and always will be forever. Now he's pissed off. Victor, it's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> this is awesome. It truly is. It's a pleasure to meet you. We're, we're very thankful that you are here to speak with us and you're listening to us and we're just happy that you can hear us. I apologize if Robert is here as well and, and anybody else who is here. I apologize. We do have an object that you could speak through and if you'd like to give us your name. See that thing isn't even going off now. Like as he's talking it's not even going off. It only goes off when they ask it to go off. Which is absolutely crazy. That would be great as well. I feel so much energy right here. Bro. Honestly, yeah. do you not? I feel so much. I treat. almost wanted to start talking about like, like it just gave me such a good feeling. I almost wanted to start talking about like the current owners. Like, yeah. the, they, the current owners bought the house, so they personally knew him. Dude, you just brought up the new owners. The new owners, yes. Michelle and Jason, truly the kindest people we've met in a very long time. 
Victor, they still see your husband from time to time. You probably already know that. I, di I didn't hear it. I, I didn't hear it. I still hear it. I still hear it. I'm gonna go I, still I, don't, hear it. I don't hear it. <laughs> he just shit himself. <laughs> Somebody walking over there? Remember we told him if he wanted wine, it was <gasps> Party, bro! I heard They're shuffling. Pro I heard shuffling. He did, did you? Carpet. Should we go that? Yes. Did you hear it? That thump. Yeah. You didn't hear it? Mate, I'm hearing like, I'm hearing like. Sound like a chair. Victor, can you come over here real quick? Did you grab some wine? Would you like us to come over there? Victor just comes on in now with like champagne. Poop! Let's fucking party, baby! I think. You're right. Whoever, whether it's Victor, Robert, or whoever, dude. Would it be okay if we continue towards the kitchen? Get the music playing. That's been a minute. That's, yeah, that's been a minute. Hang on. Like, I'm so confused when people say minute now. Like, minute is not what minute used to be. Minute now is like fucking, I don't know, fucking years and shit. Are you actually meaning a minute? This is why people shouldn't be fucking around with English, right? Don't say minute when you mean a fucking long time. If it's been, has it been a minute? Did, that confused, uh, that's confused me now. Thanks. Who is it? Fucking Drake? Let's move towards the kitchen because I think we just got a yeah, like it, that's fine. If anybody did come in here to hopefully grab a drink. We're just looking for a sign, if you could give us a sign. We're gonna pull out another object here that you can use your words, and hopefully that'll give you more ability to speak with us and have a conversation. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna walk up to Nick. He's got an object in his hand, and whatever you can think of, whether it's a name, or you just wanna say hello, or warn us about something, please feel free. What was that? What the fuck was that, mate? Warn us about something. Please, feel free. Oh! That was a maximum orb. Whenever I see that thump, I, 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 whenever I see it, I just think Trump. I'm sorry. I see Trump, not thump. Hold <laughs> <laughs> on. Where was that? <laughs> it was, wasn't it? That was you as I looked back. I thought you were coming towards me. No. Whoever we were speaking to earlier, Victor, I assume it was you. Are you still in the kitchen with us after we said you could come in? Are you still here? Oh my shit a brick, mate. Both? Both Holy of them. Crap. Like how big is fucking Victor? He's massive. Doris. Doris? Is that the woman? I was just talking about the woman, guys. There is. A little bit of negativity here. Supposedly. <laughs> there is a little bit of negativity here. <laughs> had uh, choked one of the people who had stayed here. Now, we don't know if it's because of the person themselves. Yeah, but she straddled him first, mate. Is any way malicious or not. So, but we... I don't think so. She straddled him first and then strangled him. All right, so that's... That, I, you know, I think that's just a bit kinky. We could definitely find out. Maybe we can find her name. Maybe she'll talk to us. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you were. And I said, hopefully we could get her name right away. What came? Doris. Yeah. Is that true? Dude, it's wait, wait, those wait. footsteps right down yeah. the hall. Trump. Bro, they can't continue. Let people know. Let people, Let people know. know? Let people know that's her name. Oh, is that? Dude, I don't, it might be, bro. This might be. The crazy thing is, like, the owners don't know. Right. What the if the owners don't know her name? No way. No, no, no. What if all these people have been feeling her, have been talking to her? She says her name. Maybe they haven't let anyone know. Like, look, this is my name. Like, Doris, I'm here. If you are the woman that had choked the man in the room over there, can you please let us know if you mean harm or if you did it for a specific reason? Was he acting aggressive towards you and oh. trying to provoke you? 
Are you okay? So, what? I don't know why it always gets these like feelings, mate, doesn't he? He always gets these feelings. You know? I think it's the little leprechaun inside him or something. Whoa, whoa, that was loud. Trump again? I think you'll understand that there's a ghost. It's a very special ghost. <laughs> More trumping. We mean no harm to you and we're- Alright, I'll stop, I'll stop. We're not trying to- I heard that. Where did that just- Over there? Over. By the room? Yeah. Really Where close. it happened? That's the room where it happened, yeah. We may be talking and speaking with so many different spirits, that's the thing. So we're trying to kind of focus on a couple of specific spirits. We don't know how it's gonna go tonight, which that's what's great about investigating, is you never know how things are gonna go. Yeah, he's buzzing, mate! Nick's buzzing! No. Not it could be the speaker, though. I'm nowhere near that, though. I've been planning. Planning. What do you mean? Who are we speaking with? Is it Doris? Victor? Robert? Somebody else? Anybody is welcome to speak with us tonight. We are more than happy to have a conversation. We're very fascinated with this home, this property. Sister. Sister. Hey. Sister, Sister. of who? Do you know who lives here? See, I'm not hearing some of the footsteps. <clears throat> Bro. Whoa. What was that? That was weird. That sent it straight from the portal to us. The portal? Yeah. If anybody can, maybe you can go walk over there at the to the end of the table and make that object start to ring. If you can please do that. Yeah, go by the maximum portal, mate. Let's see it. Let's go. All you have to do is walk to the end of the room. Look. Yo. No fucking way. <laughs> Thank you so much. Victor, that's gotta be you. That's fucking incredible, man. How is it that they get this much stuff all the time, every episode? I apologize, like I said, I'm probably gonna apologize plenty of times tonight. We don't know who exactly we're speaking to unless if you give us a name and we think a woman gave us her name. We don't know if she is still here. Do you hear that, bro? It's kind of freaking me out. Are you sitting over there? What was that? Okay. That's so dope, dude. <laughs> that really this cool. new this new uh, REM pod is great. Thank it's fucking loud, let me tell you, mate. That's brilliant. You can put that anywhere in the house. Thank you so much for going over there. Now, I don't know exactly what you would like from us. Maybe we can just listen to you. If you have something you'd like to tell us. We're here. We're all yours tonight. Kevin. Wait. We get that That's name. twice. Kevin? So often. Do it. Ever since the hotel night, night yeah. Carson. <sighs> the other two are walking down the hall. Oh, here we go. Let this spit up. Here? Is there any way you can let us know that you're still with us and not them? Where was that? Bro, the vibe is totally different over here. It's kind of creepy. Them? Was that them? No, 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 no. It sounded like here. Here? Yeah, really close. There was two knocks. We can do the flashlight method. I'll just go stick it right over here. What? The flashlight okay. method? What's that all about? This object here. Just so we're absolutely sure, is there any? Oh, what? Were they turn on and off the flashlight? Way. You could touch this device on the table, or just simply walk near it and let me know. Right away? Right away. Do you want me and River to walk into the dining room more and sit at the table, maybe? Is there something we should be doing? I walked barely closer and I heard a creak on the carpet. Oh, shit. Here we go, mate. It's going to go to another level now. I heard that. Yeah. Holy crap, bro. Okay, so you're definitely here. Thank you so much. Do you not want me close then? Because I don't have to be anywhere near you. Got this light here. 
What? I have this light here. What the f Mate, that's just flashing off like, like that's fucking... What? It's like a disco in here, mate. No shit. Yeah. Dude, what's going on? I literally just set it there. Pick it up and uh, have, a, have a mess with it, mate, because that seems like broke. I don't know. Is it broke? Can you turn that off? Focus. Now that I'm right here, please. In three, two, one. Please turn it off. Dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> no, turn it on, please. Use your energy. Do it I again! I really appreciate <laughs> Passage. What? So is a portal. Do it again. Turn it off. Come on. I just threw it yourself. And they turned it off. I know. And on. Can we celebrate? And on. <laughs> this is awesome, bro. Thank you so much, whoever is in here with me. Somebody's right here. One more time, if you can. Can you please turn this off? I want to show them that you can hear what I'm saying. Please turn the light off. Did you hear that? Yeah, what the f was that? I'm not gonna lie to you, that sounded like right next to me. Is that the wine cellar door? I, that sound behind why, yeah. That was the wine cellar door, huh? Yeah. Please, if you- uh, The wine cellar door, huh? <laughs> can, if you can please turn this light off. That would be amazing. You already did it once, I know you're here. I, I can feel you. I can feel your energy. That was definitely first steps. I heard that. Guys. Where is it? There's no second floor above us. How about I reset this light? If I turn it off, maybe you can turn it on for us. I'd really like to see it happen if you could. Me and River haven't seen it yet. You've been showing the guys. Whoa. That was a knock. That's a proper Whoa. knock. It got faster. Look in the cellar, please. Are you in here? If you are, we heard something in here. Was it you? <laughs> Cellars are always creepy as shit, mate. There's definitely something in that cellar. Definitely. 100%. leave they whoever they didn't like the guys they didn't please turn it off if that's true <laughs> let us know that you're here well, wait what's wrong with those two what's for the, what the fuck's wrong with with wyatt and, and nick hey f you man here or was it river i can't which one is we it heard that some activity happens here and oh wyatt oh shit Hello. mate did you not like the guy standing over there? Whoever it is? I can I can imagine, I can picture somebody sitting right here. I can just picture them. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Holy shit. Huh? Holy what? shit. Oh, hang on, that's River and Nick. Okay. Oh, I legit just looked over. Monkey! Over and I like felt someone literally standing right next to me. Really? I'm dead serious. I literally envisioned right someone standing here leaning just like I am. And they looked over to me and literally looked like locked on. I just envisioned that. That's that's incredible. You guys just had You envisioned it? What, what? What? You envisioned it? What? Well, he's, trip, he's tripping out! Get him out of there! He's tripping out! He thought he could see someone in his head. River? Yeah. This room is built into the mountain, so it's even closer to the mine. That's why it's so cold. Mm -hmm. Guys, it's extremely, extremely cold in here. Yeah. It's like you're standing outside, but worse. Is anyone what? still in here with us? Wait, <laughs> <Right away. laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. I'm not going to lie, that kind of freaked me yeah, out. Yeah, that was bro. cool. <laughs> okay, cool. Thank you for answering me. That was awesome. Oh, my God. Can you, like, make a knock, possibly? Maybe hit something? I don't understand what they're, they're doing right there now. Are they still getting him to do this light thing? Who's back here with us? A chair. Okay? What was that? Who's back here with us? 
A chair. You okay? Did you just feel something? No, someone, someone literally just came up to me and said, don't know. Oh, no. God. Shit. I'm joking, you do. That just like, I'm honestly a little freaked out. I saw, I heard something. I heard like a. <sighs> my arms are so. Right. Yeah, my arms are fucking. <gasps> This is cold and scary. I know. <laughs> it's cold and scared. I'm cold and scared. <laughs> Mate, that was a loud bang. No, that was not no. me, dude. That was like right no. behind you, too. That Hold was on, not me, bro. Uh, <laughs> I wanted to grab on to you, but I can't. It's a grab on to you, bro. <laughs> um, don't go. Don't go. We're not leaving. It's just really cold in here, but we love talking to you, so we won't go. I'm gonna set this object over here. Yeah. What? What? It turned off. <gasps> Mate, that's gonna be something that them, them standing next to it or something. It's gotta be. Are you in here making Plane. a lot? Plane. 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 We're hearing all these weird things yeah. and we're laughing about it. Yeah. That could be it. it yeah, that's absolutely... It is it. It is. It is it. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, we appreciate cool. you. So this object, if somebody is right here or all the way over there, this object is pretty much the same as the other one that we set over there on the table. The one with the two rods. This one's just one rod. So if you can maybe give us a sign through this one that you are here, I'm going to set it over there in this general area. I'm setting it right here. Mate, all this is gonna kick off now. It's gonna go to another level. Yo, we're getting surrounded. <laughs> you can't tell the closer you get to the I do it, mate. What the oh, F? This is amazing. This is amazing. I told you somebody was walking around that corner. We all get locked oh, in. Oh, I hope that door doesn't lock. Dude, yeah. I imagine we get locked in. I know. Yeah, I'd be fucking kicking that shit down, mate, if it happened. Please let go. Thank you so much. I think I think you just said something again. What? Was it? What? Was it a girl's voice? Yeah, I literally didn't even tell it's you. Like, that. No, you didn't tell me. No. But it was a girl's voice. <laughs> Dude, I heard the same thing, but they they said something else. They said something else. What did they say? I don't know what they said? But I think this is the girl that strangled, choked the guy in the bed, bro. I'm pretty positive. How do you know that? Died, Man. Over here whispering in our ears? I think so. What's in here? Is it a room? It's a bedroom. Oh, fuck me, mate. I heard that quick footsteps then, dude. Oh shit in hell, mate. This is this is paranormal activity. Can you come right over. here? Is this our room? This is mama's room. Mm -hmm. Do you hear that REM pod going off? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, She's oh. dangerous. Oh She's shit, dangerous. Hell, mate. Ooh. Run! Ooh. Who? Are you talking about the woman? That was for us. Facts. That was for us. You're <laughs> too. This is amazing, dude. Look at her. Get in there, mate. Get in there now. Go. <laughs> mate, get the fuck in there now. Investigate. Mama's room. Should we pray before we go in here? <laughs> no, just run, baby. Let's go. Okay. Nothing but respect. We're coming in. Please, nothing but respect. That was f***ing scary. That was the bathtub. That was a knock on the bathtub. Is there somebody in here? We keep hearing what sounds like footsteps. This is a beautiful room. We don't mean any harm in any way. Anxiety is oh, yeah. freaking heavy. Yeah.
All right, let's go out. All right. See, it's an old building. There could be knocks, like gentle, like creaks and stuff like that. Holy okay, shit. now, mate. Door is hard, dude. You remember earlier when you said locked us in, or yeah, you... lock. His door was like. <laughs> Imagine, bro. Imagine yeah. actually getting locked in. I know the door was harder to open. Like I don't know if I just didn't push it hard enough, but it was way harder. We think somebody's in here with us because we heard a knock right there on that that little uh, nightstand, that dresser. If you are here, this is asking for a lot. I understand. I'd like for you to maybe touch that. That's what she said. <laughs> I don't know if this is. Whoa! Did you just hear that? Mm -hmm. <coughs> <laughs> Dim, 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 Look, I've got to see that again to check his face out. Do that? Mm hmm Dim, 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 <laughs> You out here? Maximum investigation, please! <laughs> oh, shit. Did you catch me jumping, dude? I got scared. <laughs> Thank you so much. Home. 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 Yo, what do they say to everybody as soon as you walk in the door? Welcome home. Yo, Alice. Alice? Who the fuck is Alice? Alice? Who the fuck is Alice? Is that your name? It's, it's, it's a joke. It's an old school British joke, okay? Are you staying in this room with us? <laughs> Whoa, is that the hardest it's gone? Yeah, it hasn't gone this hard. That's what she said. Thank you so <laughs> much. Fucking hell. We are very thankful that you can hear us. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Careful, boys. <laughs> Fucking, he's bricking it. You good? You guys oh, good? Shit. That was crazy. Sorry, I'm, I apologize. Get out of here. Oh, shit in hell, mate. They just f***ed it up for us, bro. Guys, I think we need to do the Estes method. Because the, the, the last time when they were around there, it says, no, we, like, do you, they, they said, do you not like these two? And I said, yeah, we don't like these two, all right? And now they're there again, and they're hearing bang, 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 get get the F out of here, right? So they don't like Nick, and they don't like, um, is it Wyatt next to them? Or River? I can't, it was, it was, it was River. Right now. Yeah. Maybe we should go all dark. Yes. Yeah. All night vision. Yeah. So, yes, mate, let's, let's go. go right Okay, we are right next the to the door. original door, the door that people think has created a portal from this door to the front door, making it a passage for spirits to come and go. So what we're going to be doing is an Estes method, and how the Estes method works is we're going to use a spirit box, I'm going to hook the headphones to the spirit box, and I'm going to blindfold myself. The three guys are going to be asking questions to whoever is here with us, and they are basically going to be using me as the mouth for them to communicate and answer questions. Now here's something different. We found out how to actually get the spirit box to plug into our recorder, so everything I hear and I say, you guys are going to hear as well. Oh, cool. That's good, man. So you could definitely tell it's not like fake. That like they can hear them say, like they hear hear Wyatt saying, "Are you next to us now?" And then Rivers just like, uh, sorry, Ryan's just like, "Yeah, I'm here next to you." You know, you actually see it and hear it. That's fucking good. So with that being said, let's get into this method. Let's do this. Who's here with us? I asked you earlier. Can you give us an answer? Yeah. See, that's why this is fucking good, mate. Guys, you went to another level. Well done. I like it. You are here. Are we sitting in front of the portal? I'm dead. Like, well done. Well done to you as well, mate. Because when I hear that sort of shit, I can't hit, make heads or tails of it. Dead. What? <laughs> I'm here. See, I, I just hear like, or there, or, or, and and now that he says I'm here, I, then that makes me think, oh yeah, it could it could have said that. Dude, someone's in here. Someone's definitely in here. You remember your name? Oh, 
something so. Think so. Oh man, I don't know. That was her name. I'm Kevin. No, no, uh huh. We got Kevin early. Death. Is this the portal? Are we sitting in or near it? Must be some kind of hot tub time machine. I am. You are what? Portal. No way. The portal? So there is in fact a portal here. Is it because of the door? This door? I was feeling that. It's dark. Can you not see? Can you see us? What? I am home. This is home. This is home. That sounded like a very cheery man. Flamboyant. Victor. Victor. Yes. Victor, if this is you. Maximum orbs. Something happened to you before you passed on. What was your life like before you passed on? Were you debilitated? You what was that? Victor! It was a girl. A girl just said Victor. What? I can't hear it. See, I like I, I don't know, man. I don't know. Like there's certain words that I go, yeah, okay, that sounded like it, but I don't know, man. Anything you're saying, I'm just gonna tell you this. The girl that said Victor's name was the same voice that I heard down the hall. It was a soft woman Whoa. kind of ish young. Alice, was that did yeah. we determine? Look at that! Look at the state of that, mate! What the F? Whoever you are, whoever you are, tell me, does Victor stand? Is there anything wrong with him? The girl again. Before what? he passed on, what was he like? What is that? Right next to me, this thing with two rods coming off of it. If you get near it or you touch it, it lights up and it makes noises. And it lets us know you're oh, here. Really? Yeah. It reads your energy. So the closer you get, it'll read your energy. Do you want to try it again? Do you want to get close again? Where am I? Where am I? That fucking sketchy shit, mate. Right now, you're in what's called the Howard home. The Howard Street home. This used to be a miner's cabin. Yeah. Many years have passed. And a lot of people have lived here and moved out. Nick. Deep voice, Nick. Nick. That is my name. Hello. See, no, uh, see, I just hear... I didn't hear hello, I just heard eh. Listen. That is my name. Eh. Hello. Hi. Thank you for getting so close to me too. Do you know what year it is? Not really. See that, okay, I could say, yeah, no, not really, I could, I could hear that, sort of. Let's hear it again. Do you know what year it is? Not yet. Oh man, it's so it's so difficult. Not really. <clears throat> That's whenever I do this shit, mate, and I hear it, I'm like, I, I can't make heads or tail of it. The mace is pretty good at um, de deciphering what it says, but I I'm just like I just hear. Eh, 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 oh. Where are we? That was a different voice. Robert. That is the other guy. That's the other guy. Yeah. I, I felt that. Felt that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. just, what does that sound like to you? <laughs> what is it? It sounds like two people walking around. Who's in the main room right now? 
The living room, who's there? Oh my god, that was... Oh, it hurt people, I sort of heard that. What was that? What were those noises? Yeah, it's getting a bit sketchy now, mate. Is that the game camera? Sounded like footsteps walking person. Feels different. That's kind of hard. Something feels different. Like something was- It's getting a bit of a dark energy. I'm feeling that as well, mate. Shut up. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like something like it. It's lighter. What the fuck is that? Oh, shit. You good? I feel weird. Did you just hear that? It said Robert. Oh, it did. Somebody was like right here, dude. Somebody was literally right here. You had your hand held out. Yeah, I could feel somebody right here. Literally. I started getting really sad because I think either Robert or Victor, somebody, is like giving me some weird, weird emotion. I feel like, I, I, I don't think Victor, maybe Robert. I don't know because the owners originally said um, there is good spirits, good energy, and then they're sad. Remember? There's multiple. They're sad, right? They described a lot of the spirits. They said there's good, there's lost. I think it just says protect. Maybe you should try. I think there is lots of different types of spirits, mate, but it, it's weird because I can see their energy now. It's just like sunken a little bit. For a tiny bit. I can try. We're going to switch off here. Uh, I feel like somebody came and used a little bit of emotion in me, so I need to kind of step away from this chair and I need to see if maybe somebody can use their energy and speak through Nick. You did say my name and Let's you were go. responding a lot to things I was asking earlier. If you can, we'd like for you to explain and give us some information. We're trying to find out who exactly is here. I don't know who was standing right here. I don't know if you still are, but whoever it was, my hand, my whole left side of my body was very cold and I started feeling maybe your emotion started getting really sad. Now, if you could please explain what's going on using Nick as a mouth. Let's go, mate, let's go. <clears throat> there it goes. That's been a minute. Are you standing in here with us? I wonder if his um, thing it sets off, mate, when he's sitting there. <clears throat> what? Are you with Nick right now? Can we speak with you? Is that you using your energy? Speak with us, please. That was a knock right next to you, too. I'm here, maybe? Where? Are you over in this general area next to me? Or are you more next to Nick? Okay, I don't know if you guys are talking, but it feels like- Oh, shit! Like someone is standing right in front of me. Okay, I don't know if you guys are talking, but it feels like someone is standing right in front of me, like leaning over me. <laughs> oh, do you like, see that? getting really oh. close to me. Do you see that? Like, it feels like someone's oh. grabbing onto the chair and like leans <laughs> close to me, but I don't hear anything. What the fuck, mate? So he's describing like something's like on him right now, and the fucking thing's flashing like no tomorrow. No one's talking. Like, it's making my heart race. Oh, what the hell? Somebody's right there. Who is this? What's your name? We're not gonna do this much longer. Please give us some information. I don't know if it was a name, but it sounded like me. You still feeling that? Somebody's around him. Yeah. Somebody's right here. Well, Who's close to me right now? Because it feels like someone's here. still right here. They're not, mate! They're over you! All the spirits are over you, Nick! <laughs> it's not me. Is that me? No. What the hell? Mate, there's, there's about 20 fucking people in that room right now. Please let go. <laughs> oh my god. To be fair, that was quite quick. That was quite quick to let go once he just said that. Say something. I'm getting over you. I really haven't heard you at all.
Can you please come up to this one? I know you're here. Look at that, mate! There's somebody definitely here. That's a lot of energy. Yeah, I am. That's heavy. Yeah. Like, what the fuck is going on, man? Everything's beeping and buzzing and zapping and God knows what. Yes, yes, I am. They were talking quite a bit when I had them on. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, is like, I couldn't understand. Oh, look, yeah, 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 yeah. I see it, I see it. Right down here, mate, right down here. And everybody. So I kind of just chose the words that I could definitely, like, tell what they said. Maybe we should stop this and, and work, try to figure something else out, huh? Yeah. Yeah, they're not necessarily giving us, like, that much information, if you guys have noticed. But then again, since there is a portal, like I explained, dude, there could be so many spirits here, man. Mm -hmm. well, and like I said, who knows what's going to happen, because we, we wanted to try to focus on some specific people that we know of here, but you never know what's going to happen. Oh. Uh, what? But. I've never seen that shit before, mate. And that, you, you can't mess with that. You never know what's gonna happen. Did that just that just turn right off in and front on of you? right in front of me? Did anybody catch that? Yeah, I did. I, I think I did too. Yeah, I did. What the hell, mate? Devices don't do that. Now, you know those devices. I I, I think you can manipulate in some way. Whether Twin Paranormal are doing it, I don't think so. But you can manipulate the 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 pulse going up. I don't know, firing some sort of thing or whatever. But to turn it off and on again, mate, I don't think you can do that shit. We, we can get two angles. Yeah. Guaranteed. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. Is that on now? <laughs> I love that the pig is so excited. <laughs> <laughs> it did something literally. That was a reset. <laughs> can you guys, can you guys, do you guys remember what you just heard? Did it? Look at Nick going fucking daredevil on his ass, mate. Look. What the f*** is that, dude? Something just moved. That's not like that in the kitchen. That like, like a table being moved. Yeah. You guys, when you heard it turn off and on, I I swear I heard the actual switch flick. Flick, yeah. flicking. We can stop right now. Maybe <clears throat> give us a sign that you would like to try something else. Okay. Oh. Mate, everything's going off. That's going off. That's going off. He's hearing shit, mate. Deeper voice, man. He said, okay. Somebody's right here, dude. Somebody's literally right here. Okay. You're good. That okay was a confirmation that we can stop this. Really? Yeah. Were you sitting the whole time? Yeah. What? Okay, let's move out of here. Mate, he's freaking out. Okay, we'd like to finish up our conversation here. If you have anything you'd like to say, anything more, we've been trying to have a conversation with whoever. And I am gonna say this. Whoever has been communicating with us through our objects, through that, all of the objects that we have, Thank you so much for showing us that you are indeed here. You've said a couple of things through our object that you were able to use your words. Now we'd like to just kind of sit here with you and hopefully, hopefully we can get a little bit more information what? from you. If not, we don't blame you. We understand you're using a lot of energy and we tried to give you as much as we could. Now, if you don't mind, please, if you can manifest the rest of what energy you have to speak with us and to finish up this conversation, that would be great. We'd love to hear everything from whoever is here with us. Fucking Ryan's there looking for bloody water, mate. I'm sure they've got taps in there, dude. If there is anybody here, somebody who was standing behind me, I'm assuming, because the object... Behind me just lit up. Oh my god, that just scared the shit out of me. Can you please point to where you are? <laughs> Holy shit, that scared the shit out of me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Dude, what, what oh my happened? god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What just happened? Dude, I didn't I did not move these, bro. I did not move these. I can feel them literally being held. Where exactly are you? Can you touch just one of Imagine these devices? Imagine it just went out. Like, ah, Start spinning around like a helicopter, mate. Isis, the closest one you're to. Nick. The rods. Nick. What? Can you straighten them? 
What the fuck, mate? Straighten those. Yeah? Somebody's behind me. Somebody's behind you. Just literally went all the way by. Oh Just my shit. The music. The music. <laughs> fucking Ryan's out. Oh, what the fucking hell? It was spinning round everywhere, mate. Box was just going music on. box that too. Somebody was just walking in front of the music. Neff, bro. Dude, this is crazy. And the line straightened. I asked for the lines to straighten. Cross them. Guys, I'm not doing this shit. I'm not doing this. Oh my god. You can, yeah, you, can, you can't see his hands moving. Thank you. I know it's like subtle movements to make those things move, but... Who's here? Is this Victor? Is this Robert? Robert. Nobody's, nobody's filming that? Can I take that as a yes? That's a yes? Guys, they're crossing. They're crossing. What? What the fuck is that? What is that? What was that? Guys, they're crossing. They're crossing. What the fuck? I got you this whole time. I, Nobody's I filming felt... the music at all. Look at it go. It's going. I felt something. What was that? I don't think they they noticed that. I fucking did. Something in the floor when that started going off too. I absolutely feel something's behind me. I keep making that go off, please. Is it Robert by any chance? Why? That's insane. That was heavy. Can you point the rock? That is there. Where you are standing, please. Can you point both of them? Whoa. Guys, I'm getting hella chilled out. Whoa. Both of them where Actually? you are? Oh, that is probably a reflection. Uh, okay, it's a reflection of this. Okay, on the lens. All right. That's a camera. Oh, Somebody mate. Is to the right. Somebody's to the left. How many are in here? Look at look at the rod. Look at the rod. Yeah, look at it. Yeah, they're just staying there to the right. Do you see? They're like tugging on it. Yeah, they're, they are straight tugging. Whoever this camera. is to the right of me is tugging on them, dude. Guys, guys, behind you too. Just at the doorway. They're shuffling behind me. Yes, I, I heard that too. Ooh, the rods are pointing that direction, guys. This is <sighs> scary. The ghosts are tugging on the rods. So she said, "I know it's a bit delayed there. I'm so sorry, but I, I was I was involved, mate. I was in the I was in the moment." You like the music, don't you? Yeah. Trumping. Yeah, I did too. I did too. Look at the rods. This may be a little hard. That's what Can she you said? touch one of these devices in a specific number? Oh my okay. god, did you guys you see that? Did you yeah. guys <laughs> Everyone's fucking shitting themselves now. <laughs> Dude, that, the rods literally just pointed to that and it just fing went off. No, I heard they that. literally just went yeah, off. Yeah, I saw that. That scared the shit out of me, bro. That freaked me out. What I was gonna ask <laughs> is, can you touch one of these devices in a specific number that lets me know how many are here? One, two. Three. Four. Five. Dude, what's going on, guys? This is this is actually getting really creepy. I don't know. Like, I have cold chills. Mate, what the fuck? I'm, like, shaking. Like, you can just feel it. I'm, like, shaking. Like, I feel horribly, horribly nervous. Me too. I'm really nervous as well. Okay, let's try this. What is that floating right here? Hmm? Huh? Does anybody see it? I just saw something float. My vision's a little weird. The blue light is... I just really saw bright. something float. I see it? You see it? It is right in front of Nick. Is it an orb? I don't know what that was. Can you see orbs through the naked eye? Something yeah. floated. I watched it with my own eyes. It floated straight through the object on the table. I thought it was just the brightness of the light. Okay, how about let's try this. Now that you've moved away from the objects, we want you to answer some questions with these rods if you can. If they close, if you can make them close, that means a yes. If you move them away from each other, that means a no when we ask a question, okay? Please answer the questions that we ask. 
Are you still in here with us? So that's a yes. Are there multiple of you? Went back and forth, so that's a yes as well. We asked earlier, is this Victor? Keep an eye on his hands. They're not moving, mate. They're crossing. They are. Victor's here somewhere. Okay, make the lines go straight. <laughs> Thank you. This is so weird, bro. How about Robert? Is Robert here? I did. Yeah, uh-huh. That's also a yes, I believe. <laughs> that, that, it'd be good if he was blindfolded with those rods. That would be good. There's someone else. Someone we don't know about. The Ooh. first no. Ooh, the first no. Victor and Robert? Victor and Robert, just both of you. What about the woman? The woman that everyone talks about, where is she? Is she here? Are you pointing where she is? What? <laughs> Mate, those rods are going off at another her, level. You? Is she the one that likes Nick? I forgot that was on. I forgot that She's was on. Behind. You're behind us, what? aren't you? Oh my what? god, dude, that was weird as shit, bro. What? God. What is going on, dude? I don't know. Without asking you questions, I'd, I'd truly just like to say we mean you no harm. We mean you no harm and thank we you so you much no for harm. talking to us and spending this time. You probably don't get to do that too much and people are probably aggressive and mean and try to call you out. No, don't get to probably do don't get this too much. Yeah, you don't get this too much. That would make sense. Yes. yes. Are you okay with us being here? No! Get the fuck out! Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you, we really appreciate you. Can you straighten them out? Yeah, that was. I hear that shuffling. Can you look if, if the owner is here? I swear to God, somebody just walked. Nothing. Nothing's different. Did anybody hear that? Like, you heard it, right, Nick? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You did too, mm -hmm. Wyatt? You heard it? It sounded like hardwood floor. Somebody was just shuffling their feet, dragging yeah. their feet along. Oh, mate, mate, mate. You're doing, mate. You're doing the this is freaky as fuck. Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay. We just wanted to say thank you so much, whoever is here. Victor, Robert, and whoever else is here. We're not sure, we're not 100% sure if the girl told us her name. Like, maybe you did. The information that you did give us tonight, we're happy with. We just wanted to come here and have a conversation with you because this is what we like to do. We, we want to let you know that there are people out there that still want to hear from you. So we just want to say thank you. Ooh. Dude, so Everything's fucking going off, mate. Wait. Did you hear that whatever that was? What the hell, man? Do you hear that? Are you hearing that? They always, at the end, they always have some sort of, like, massive ending, don't they? Like, you know, everything goes off and, you know, it's just like, it finalizes things. Okay, Ghost Gang. Uh, we're gonna wrap it up from here. I think tonight went pretty well, okay? If you guys yeah. do want us to come back here, you guys know what to do. 15,000 likes, you guys are so good at doing the whole like thing. So, we might as well continue with it. If you guys do want us to come here, one more time or how many ever times you guys just let us know down in the comments a huge thank you to jason and michelle they are the sweetest people that we've literally met we've met some really good people during a couple of our investigations and whatnot but these two who own this place they have the best hospitality in the world a huge thank you to you two thank you so much you guys are the best Legends. with that being said guys i hope you guys did enjoy this episode and we will see you next week. And then the ghost is saying cheers as well. Was that just a buy? The ghost is saying like, s subscribe and do the thing. I think it was. <laughs> see you next week. Holy <laughs> shit.
Dude, that was crazy. <laughs> Fucking hell, man! Get the merch at caspersite.com. Just Rambo it. Whenever I watch those uh, twin paranormals, I just get sucked in so much. It just gets better and better as the episode goes on, man. So damn good. Make sure you go over to their channel, subscribe, and do the thing. And make sure, if you like this video, you like and do the thing. And also subscribe, because it's free. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.